Okay, it's a wonderful atmosphere right here in Lagos, Nigeria, and it is joined the cast called the Nigeria's finest Alibaba GCFR in collaboration with other entertainers coming together for this unique idea to champion the cause for malaria in Nigeria. Now, we are saying World Malaria Day is a novelty match right here and we want to believe it's going to be an awesome experience at the end of the day. Now, we're just setting this on WinTV247 on YouTube and we shall be bringing celebrities, on-air personalities to come and share their thoughts about the process we're having here in order to make sure we have a very sustainable society. My name is Christopher Morris and I'll see you after this timer. Hi, this is Ike Chiku Roland of the BSL West Africa and you're watching Win TV 247. You're watching Win TV 247. Win TV? Yes, Win TV. Win TV. If you want to hear, you better join. Win TV 247. Win TV 247. We we'll cover the coverage globally. Okay, for every industry, we have veterans and professionals, and we have Nigeria's finest championing the cause for a sustainable society right here in Lagos, Nigeria. It is the World Malaria Day, and we're standing with Alibaba. Boss, how are you? You're fine. Straight up, sir. You, you and your team have been able to gather major stakeholders in Nigeria, and we're here for one cause: malaria. How does it feel having this response? No, I think I think that it, it's high time that we build awareness. And uh, if we wait for people to build their awareness and people are not doing it, then we have to take the bulls by the horn or take the mosquito by the bite. Anyway, we, we have to just woke up and do something. And when uh, my guy, come, 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 come. When my guy came up with the idea, and I, I, I thought that it was something worthy of yeah. support. Yeah. And uh, he's the brain behind it, and then uh, he calls us to, to join the platform. So I'm going to ask you this big one. Yeah. There is a communicator that is going to come in out from this whole process that started months before now. Okay. What is the high point of this initiative? The high point is that we need to be careful about how we maintain our environment. We need to make sure that our environments are clean. We have to use mosquito treated nets. We need to go for tests. And we shouldn't just. Because wrong diagnosis is another big problem. When you when you have malaria, go for treatment. Don't self medicate. All right. And then, as much as possible, one tell one. Let us spread the awareness. Let us tell people that malaria is dangerous and it's dangerous. And we need to keep a clean environment. And starting with this, an entrepreneur in the ICT industry, and we got a fashionista right here who is going to be giving us his perception about this idea. But let's go from IK because I know that. Let's let's get to meet you officially now. Okay, my name is Ike Chikuroland. Yeah. I'm the director of web technologies of BSI, West Africa. Hmm. This is this is interesting. Let's let's talk to you, sir. My name is Shedrag Hausman. Yeah. A fashion entrepreneur, a creative director of TBR, the Bispo Real Clothing Company. Okay. Now you know that we're talking about on air personalities and we're talking about the comedians, the singers as well. And these are the people that grace the stage and they want to wear something quite bespoke, like what you're seeing right now. But let's go from here. Okay. Ike. How does it feel seeing Nigerians coming together to talk about something like this, malaria? Well, um, I feel it's um, something that cannot be overlooked. Yeah. Like um, malaria kills a lot of kids, I've seen thousands of kids globally, yeah. especially in Africa. Yeah. You understand? And you know we have the worst case of uh, malaria, death, you know, mortality and all that stuff. Yeah. So I feel um, such an awareness, you understand, is paramount and is needed, wow. you understand, to actually... Um, um, improve the awareness, you understand? Wow. Okay. Because so that we'll be able to at least end, if not end, at least reduce the mortality rates, you understand, that malaria is causing in Africa. I get your point. Let me take from here. What I'm going to be asking you is in relation with the, the celebrities. Now, you, you relate with the celebrities a lot, and coming to this kind of atmosphere, seeing celebrities not raising their shoulders, bringing their egos down, come to a field like this to have a novelty match for malaria. What do you think? It's really good to bringing themselves to, to not not on a really high level, but trying being able to bring themselves down to be able to partake in such events, yeah. which is really good. It's also encourage other people to come in and watch the comedian and the air personality to actually come together to 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 to, to be in this kind of event to yeah. come together anyway to 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 play together and for other people to come and watch too. Wow, this is awesome. Now we're talking about comedians like Alibaba, Nigeria's finest. Okay, let's take one last one. A lot of partners here. What what would be your words? What's going on in your mind? Why do you think they're partnering with this idea? Well, like I said, it's a global issue. Okay. Right? And everybody's involved. Yeah? So we yeah. all have to play our own part. You understand? To 
reduce the mortality rate for malaria in Africa. Yeah. You understand? And also increase awareness, right, for people so that they will know certain things that need to be done. Like now, I see this uh, as a welcome atmosphere, right? Wow. Whereby we have um, comedians, yeah, we have on air personalities, you yes, are coming together to play a match, you understand? For everybody to watch. Wow. You understand? And with all the sponsors like Martin, um, Traffic, um, the Lagos State, I feel it's, it's a good stuff. stuff. Alright, we'll dry the cotton here for this part of it, but more faces coming your way on Win TV 247 on YouTube. TBR Boss here and IK, ICT professional and entrepreneur here in Nigeria. My name is Iberi Nami. I'm here representing Frenzy in partnership with Traffic for this World AIDS Marias Day. Uh, Frenzy is a new social network for university students in Nigeria. It's pretty, pretty, pretty new. Now, how does it feel being a partner to this event? Oh, traffic uh, traffic has, yeah, is an in-house friend to us, so okay. it's kind of like a big family. So there was no question about it. It's just the right thing to do. Exactly. Now, looking at malaria in this part of the world, what do you think? Do you think it's a very good idea having a novelty match for malaria? Yeah, it is a very good uh, idea. But for the past uh, three weeks or so, the campaign has been going on. Wow. Uh, social media, radio, print, online and all. So okay. the awareness is already there so that people can know what to do to even to kind of like in the eradication of uh, malaria. Okay, that's cool. Now, to the boss. Now, he plays in a particular industry I don't want to mention, but let's hear it from him. So let's meet you officially. <laughs> uh, Jerry Wright, I work in a PR firm. Now, you people talk to people a lot. Your profession, you communicate with people a lot. And we understand how far malaria has been in this particular part of the world before we started having curative measures to it. How does it feel having this set of people coming together to champion the cause for a campaign on kicking out malaria? Well, I think you cannot play down the power of celebrities. You know, the best way to push out a brand, a product, a service, an initiative, uh, better put, an idea is to use celebrities. Even with Martin, you know that among me is the ambassador. The ambassador you know, so I think the whole idea of bringing OAPs who are very influential people in the society nowadays and um, uh, comedians who are equally influential wow. is a very good idea. So many people are coming here just to watch the football match. Others are coming just to see their favorite OAPs and comedians. But at the end of the day, they are gaining something. They are learning more about malaria. Are getting more awareness, you know. So I think it's a good now. Your words for traffic communications to keep the flag flying. What are your words for them? Oh, uh, you know, the promoters of traffic have really done a good job. Uh, my oh. advice for them is to, you know, keep on keeping on, okay. you know, uh, keep up the good work. It's a good initiative. They have started well, and uh, they should just keep the flag flying. I want to thank you very much. Okay, more faces on your way. Queen TV 247 right here, Lagos, Nigeria. We'll be right back. Manny, how does it feel being part of the process quickly? I feel great. I feel awesome. You know, I, I, I like this kind of thing because we're trying to identify with positivity, fighting something that nobody wants to talk or uh, fight about globally. It's a big problem. Malaria is a war we can win. Your words yeah. to the organizers quickly. Your words to the organizers. Superb. One on love. point. On point, please. You do your thing. This is actually the generation that this particular campaign is all about. It is World Malaria Day, and this is Lagos, Nigeria. We have partners. The comedians are here, the on-air personalities are here, and we have schools, organizations coming together to make sure that we say no to malaria. Let me quickly meet these two finest here. What's your name, beautiful? Hi, it's Adel. What's your name? Alaria. And you are? My name is Shetunbeda Mola. What is the name of your school? The name of my school is St. Mary Convent School. Wow, we're proud to be standing here with St. Mary Convent School. We have the mothers. The teachers and the educators that are taking care of them. Mommy, what's your name? I'm Mrs. Enang, Justina Enang from Butelefu Primary School. Wow, it's a pleasure. Mommy, what about you? Ibokwe good. Okay. Now, let's find out from you. What are we doing here today? We are celebrating the World Malaria Day. Wow, awesome. And what about you? What are we doing here today? We are celebrating the Malaria World Malaria Day. Okay, quickly. What do you understand by malaria? Do you think we should kick malaria out of the society? Yes. Okay, what are you saying to other young children? Do you want to advise them how they can take care of themselves so that we can avoid malaria? Okay, yes. go ahead. The camera is watching you. We should use mosquito nets so that the malaria will not spread over the world. Oh, you got that now. Let's just meet the mothers quickly. Mommy, what do you have to say about this celebration today? Now it's a very nice celebration. Yes, ma'am. So I will advise the young one. To keep the environment very clean. Wow. I think that's the, 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 the most important thing. Okay. And mosquito nets 
is necessary for the children and the entire family. Okay, ma, we have somebody putting on this particular traffic here. Madam, please, can you come close? Let's get to meet you. What's your name, ma? My name is Buda Okoso. Okay, ma, what do you do? I'm the director of our treasure leisure center. I brought these children here. Wow, this is awesome. Madam, today you have a lot of partners. Yes. And you are a partner too. To yes, this to traffic. How does it feel being, being a partner? Ha! It's, you know, you can't do this thing alone. You have to work with people. Yeah. I, mean, I run an uh, NGO with youth development. Okay. So when traffic came to me, I said, I'll bring school children because we need to do this one. Children, pregnant women, wow. Margaret women, wow. the media. We should work together, together. and yeah. rid the society of malaria. Now, you will not believe what we're seeing right here. We were actually thinking we we're going to be seeing just all their personalities and the comedians. But no, the children are here and school we have children. school children to be precise. And we have a mother that is running an NGO championing the cause for a sustainable society. Ma, take one minute and please talk to the people watching us right now on how they can take care of their environment. We should uh, clean our environment every, every Saturday. Okay. We should go for government once a month. Okay. Tide, uh, clean your gutters. Um, don't allow water to be in your, in your gutters and, 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 okay. and all that. And also, take away your refuse. Don't keep your refuse on the streets and in the gutters and okay. everything. Wipe your hands when you finish washing. Wash your hands and keep the environment clean. Government can't do it alone. We need to partner with government to do it. Wow. Government is us. Wow, this is awesome. And this is where we're actually signing up with these kids. More faces coming your way. More school children coming your way with their teachers, just in case you want to know. And we're doing this on the largest TV on the internet, YouTube. And this is Win TV 247. Thanks to my partners, yeah. Cool FM, Wazobia, Nigeria, Info, Beat FM, City FM, STV, Fly Ninja. Hi, this is Ike Chukuroland of WSL West Africa. And you're watching Win TV 247. You're watching Win TV 247. Win TV? Yes, Win TV. Win TV. If you want to win, you better join. Win TV 247. Win TV 247. We cover the coverage globally from Africa to Asia, America, the Middle East, and Europe.